Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 Online, the most machismo-soaked, adrenaline-filled Mountain Dew Fest available on YouTube. I welcome you back. I'm level 4. And we're gonna get into another game. Have you guys ever noticed that pretty much every time you turn Steam on, Team Fortress 2 updates again? How much do they really need to add to this game at this point? Hasn't it been out for like four or five years? Have you worked at a peanut butter factory? Peanut butter? His name is Phil McCracken. <laughs> you never know what you're going to get into when you turn this game on. It's just that guy laughing that makes me laugh. I don't get the fucking... <laughs> I'll let them do I said for me. Phil McCracken with peanut butter? <laughs> My dog loves it. <laughs> oh my god. My no, dog I don't I don't butter. fill my crack in with peanut butter and then let my dog eat it. No. I just show him pictures of it. I just show him pictures of it. He's very visual. <laughs> so anyway, apparently Donald Trump hired a bunch of goats and he raises them just to grow his hair. Yeah, and they live in the plaza fucking hotel, dude. <laughs> hired a Oh man, I'm gonna have to thank them. <laughs> what do you think a hair goat hair goats crack peanut butter? I don't even know what to say. These guys, every time you come on here, there's some ridiculous shit going down. <laughs> they need something to liven up this loading screen. Need to throw in, like, uh, I don't know, what does Infinity Ward have? They, they don't have Pac-Man, that would be nice. They don't have Tetris. They just have shooting other dudes. Maybe if you could shoot more dudes... Well, you wait to shoot dudes. Or, or they could advertise en energy drinks to you on this screen. That would be a useful thing. They could have a connect to the internet and grab dynamic ads. Anyway. Cool, so I made a custom class, I guess. Wow, my gun looks really shiny. I only have iron sights because I guess I'm a noob. So I gotta earn a laser scope or something. Go up here. I feel like probably a good idea to hang out in this corner, maybe. Just saw a guy over there, didn't I? No, it's probably just a little moving piece of paper. That's super boring. Where's the action at? There it is, right in my face, the second I choose to move forward. Why is it F to respawn instead of click? I guess to keep you from accidentally missing your kill cam or something. And there we go again. That's quite a movement on the gun. And my fraps is really lagging the shit out. I think I hit him again. Oh. That's what I get. I always sit and I, I aim at the same thing for way too long. It's a problem I seem to have. So let me tell you about something I'm really excited for. I just read that there's going to be... Well, I knew this was going to happen eventually, but I just read that this is about to happen now, like really soon. That there's going to be a Portal 2 level editor with... Uh, Steam, what do they call it, the, like the tool shop or whatever, some kind of support for a service that allows me to share my levels, which is pretty cool. That is exactly the kind of stuff I'm into. Oh. Somebody's going to get me from behind in a second, right? Yeah, yeah, okay, let's go over here then. 
There he is. I knew he wouldn't let me down. What's a game of Call of Duty without being shot in the back every three seconds? I actually had this theory, like, it seemed like at times guys could exist exactly in your peripheral shot, like, viewpoint, so you couldn't ever see them. And it seemed to be like a lot of the times they could just sort of ride out your movement in that exact spot, so you never actually noticed them there. It seemed nearly impossible that people could, uh be that good at the game that they could always stand in exactly the right spot that they couldn't be seen. But then again, maybe I completely underestimate how skilled these guys are. Well, skilled is an interesting word for it. Robot-like, maybe, is more accurate. Have I killed a single guy yet? Uh, nope. I've died eight times, though. That's pretty cool. I'm juiced. There goes somebody. Hey, headshot. Got pretty lucky on that. Not sure how I feel about the level design in this one. Whoa, hello. It feels unnecessarily windy, but I guess that's what you want when you're doing a shooter. Really? Ah. No! I am so bad at this now. There was a while that I used to actually get pretty decent kill streaks. I used to actually play this every few nights. Had a group of people that I would play it with. I'm, I'm sort of embarrassed to admit this now because this is not... <sighs> this is not the coolest thing to be doing every night. But, you know, I'm on YouTube either way, so why not? And we're just about to lose, which is awesome. Oh, cool. Let's see if I can get one more kill before we lose. Nope. Oh, wait, you still his kill count. Oh, I'm completely man. sleeping. That was pretty sad. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I drank a half a bottle of whiskey and smoked some other stuff. Good for you. I'm gonna have to trade some games in to get this game, guys. Too much fun. <laughs> I think that's an excellent way to close this episode <laughs> but I still out. Later.